So this is a book I chose to read for my CPT. It is called The Shack and is written by W.M. Paul Young. My favorite character in the novel is Mac, due to the fact that during his whole journey to the shack and everything he went through, I felt like I was right there with him, so I kind of felt a connection with him. So pretty much what this book is about is it is about a family who went camping for the weekend, and one of his sons and one of his daughters went kayaking, and they flipped the kayak, so Mac ran out there to go and help them and as they ran out uh their youngest daughter named missy went missing so they the cops were called and everything and they went for a search for them and they ended up finding the missy's clothes covered in blood in a shack and then the novel goes like two years later and the father's really grieving and then he receives a letter in the mail and it says come to the shack from papa and for Papa to his, uh, Mac McKenzie's wife is God to her. So Mac didn't know if it, someone was just playing a practical joke or it actually was God. So what Mac did is he says he was going away for the weekend. He told his wife and the wife let him go. So he went to the shack, not knowing if it was going to be the killer, not knowing if it was just a joke or if it actually was God. So he ends up showing up at the shack. And he goes inside, looks around, and he notices nothing. Nothing's wrong, so he's mad. He's really mad at this time, and he really starts questioning his faith. He's like, why is God, is God's not real? He doesn't do anything for me. Why would he kill, Why would he take my daughter from me? So he walks away from the shack, really mad, really angry. And he notices, looks around, and he notices the snow is melting. And he looks around, looks back at the shack, and now the shack is a beautiful place. It's a big giant shack, a big, not a shack, it's a big giant house. And he walks inside, he, knock, he looks inside the door and he sees a big uh, African American woman who's cooking and he walks inside and she hugs him and says, I've been waiting for you. And God didn't know, and Mac didn't know this at the time, but that was God and she appeared to him in a human form as an as a large African-American woman, and he te she teaches him a lot of lessons. Also at the shack, he meets a Asian woman named Sarah Yu, which is in the book, The Holy Spirit, and he also meets Jesus, who appeared to him as a man. I think he was of Jewish descent. And all of those people t taught him lessons about life, and also about his faith. By the end of the experience, he did have faith in God, and they also taught him not to grieve over his daughter's death, because now she is in a better place. So, I did like this novel. It was very enjoyable to read. I, for the first time, I wasn't bored while reading a book. Like, as he was traveling to the shack, I was very intense. It was very intense because he was very nervous about traveling there and didn't know if it was true or not. And I really liked that. This book is a fiction novel, but it kind of feels like it's a true story because it, it feels very like real. Because when you're in the when you're reading the book, it feels very real to you. I personally, I didn't even know it was a fiction novel until my mother told me. So, yeah, I really did like The Shack. It was a great read. And I would recommend it to other people. And yeah.